Did you see that? Guys, we got fish on. We're at Mayan Princess. Last day of May. Found ourselves a fish. I'm not sure what he is yet. He's got nice conditions. Uh, maybe a foot and a half swells. Uh, surf was not too difficult. I got about 15 guys following me out. I see a couple of them a quarter of a mile away. go. Not bad first one. Fish on again. They're right on this corner. Be back. Good morning. That's a strong fish right here. I'm gonna wrap for that rig. This might be bonus points right here. This is a really pretty king. He's definitely a bonus. Whew! <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Come on, come on. You got a camera? Yeah. Get her on. Ah. How's that? <laughs> Woo! Well, today's trip brought to you by Santa Cruz. This is a fantastic boat and it is working really well. Let me show you what I'm doing today. I'm running the fish bag and the bump board in the back. Got my drift chute set, ready to go if I need it. Got drinks underneath. Uh, using my uh, star ports and my rail blazer rod holders. Working good. Uh, I had a limit of fish by 7:30, and by 8:30 at that big rig, I had a, I had two fish hit at the same time. One of them bit through the steel leader. I was using a thinner 42 pound steel leader to try to attract smarter fish. I did, but he bit the leader in half. So uh, the other leader got bit right after that, and or the other rod 
and it had that big mid 50s king he's a fat king she we'll keep fishing we're gonna go see that rig this is north or uh, yeah north of the Mayan princess set and I've done well at that rig a couple of times Shh, don't tell anyone so nobody's on it it's been real quiet I'm gonna just sneak over here and drift around maybe tie up and catch a ling if we can jigging at the rigs and I think I just caught my first kingfish on my little baby rod all right the little rod Got a decent fish. I don't know what it is. Three hundred yards of twenty on this little bitty line, or in this little bitty reel, so we should be fine. I know. I wouldn't like a hook in my forehead either. Sorry about that. Of course, you're the one that did it. Thank you for flying Salt Airlines. Please make sure all trays and seat backs are in the upright position. Prepare for departure here shortly. I think in Jack speak, that means he loves Professor Salt Outdoors. Found a partial to it myself. So. There you go, little Jack.